Primal Cryogenic System is now bringing cryosurgery to a new level with the Cryac Tracker. Cryac Tracker, a new service that tracks the time and tells you the temperature of the lesion being frozen. Now you can consistently achieve the desired skin temperature and freeze time every time. The Cryac Tracker allows for more precise and effective cryosurgery. Features include temperature monitoring. The infrared light sensor continuously and safely monitors the skin temperature at the freeze site. Color-coded lights shine on the lesion to indicate how fast the skin temperature is decreasing and when the desired skin temperature is reached. Easy-to-read LCD screen displays skin temperature on time. Cryac Tracker Quick Start Guide Your Cryac Tracker is supplied with batteries already fitted. To turn on the device, press button 1. This will show a startup screen with the current previous T-min setting. It will also be in the same mode setting the unit was in when it was powered down. Before using the device, turn the tracker unit on and carry out a simple self-test. When the display is turned on, the temperature reading in the main box will read room temperature. Now focus the two blue beams together on the back of your hand. The temperature reading should be 30 degrees C, plus or minus 3 degrees C. To adjust T-min, press and hold button 2 until set mode 1 appears in the screen. Press button 2 once more, and the current T-min setting will appear. Using button 3, adjust T-min to the required setting. Press button 1 once to save the T-min setting. Begin treatment. To turn the device off, press button 1. Hold it for 2 to 3 seconds. During the treatment, the LEDs will change color as follows. Blue equals actual temperature to 0 degrees C. Green equals 0 degrees C to T min. Red equals less than T min. To change the operating mode, press button 1 to turn power on. Press and hold button 2. It will display the previous mode. To change the mode, press button 3 to scroll to the desired mode. Press button 1 to save the setting. Routine maintenance. Cleaning. If necessary. The plastic case can be cleaned with a clean damp cloth and soapy water or alcohol wipe. The cloth should only be moist and not dripping wet to reduce any risk of water entering the device. Avoid using abrasive cleaners that could scratch and damage the surface of the tracker. Also, avoid touching or contaminating the optical sensors and light emitting diodes on the tracker. Battery Replacement The battery compartment is located on the top of the main housing. 
to remove the AA batteries. Open the upper lid and remove the batteries from the compartment. Replace the batteries and close the lid. Filling the Cryac Tracker Place one hand around the neck of the Cryac Tracker and unscrew the bottom half. Place the units on a safe, stable area. Put on the protective gloves. Remove the Dewar lid. Place the withdrawal tube in the Cryac unit first, then lower it into the Dewar, pushing down to create a seal. Fill the unit about three quarters full. Release the seal by slowly raising the withdrawal tube with the unit out of the doer and place the withdrawal tube in the handle of the doer. Replace the lid on the doer. Screw the Cryac Tracker unit back together. Now it's ready to use.